All right, we want, to, we want you to take a look at something. While at first glance, this may not seem like the best use of time at school. Yeah, but believe it or not, all of this you see here, this is actually educational. There is an educational purpose behind all of this. News 5 photojournalist Dave Columbine captures all of the pumpkin chunkin' action from Bay Village tonight. Okay, 10's in. We are at the pumpkin chunkin' contest which is a STEM program for sixth grade students. An annual tradition here at Bay Middle School, currently in Cahoon Park because it's sort of outgrown what, where we traditionally would have had it at the middle school. Halt! 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 We currently have students who are launching pumpkins with catapults that they've built and constructed over the last several weeks. Starting in early September when they signed up. We're ready to go in about two minutes here. Mr. Eilenberger is one of our sixth grade teachers. Oh, nice start. Wow, nice beginning. He started this as just a relatively small idea and it took on a life of its own. To really encourage our students to. We probably could have gotten the record if it didn't break. Explore different careers and different opportunities within the STEM field. Started as a very small event and now we've got. You know, more than 85 to 90 percent of our sixth grade students involved in this. We've got like half of Bay Village out here right now to celebrate. Nice girl. That's awesome. That's so fun to build with my son. Their children and their neighbors and their families. And really, it's just good fun and an opportunity for students to design and explore and get out of the classroom and just have a really unique and authentic learning experience with their peers. Potential energy. Oh, nice shot. It's just been an electric kind of vibe for what? us. What I've been seeing are students engage with each other. Right. They're problem solving when things don't go the way that they anticipated. Oh, there's a beaut Oh! They're celebrating when things do. We've had a record-breaking uh, launch earlier today. Hey guys, good job, two fives. I heard a couple of, of uh, students saying it was halfway to Canada. Oh, it's still going. So there's nothing wrong with that. We'll get back to your score in a second here once they come back from the lake. I look forward to continuing the tradition and continue to uh, expand on it and get, you know, keep our kiddos engaged and having great experiences while they're at the middle school. 130 yards. <laughs> I That's bet so fun. all the kids at that school look forward to today. Yeah, <laughs> and they'll remember it too. Yes. That's awesome. And they're learning STEM. Yeah. It seemed like it was very competitive. You go too far, you'll end up in Lake Erie playing too much. <laughs> <laughs>